Hello. We have to unmute that. Hello, hello, hello. It is I, your favorite me. <laughs> Hi. How's everyone? Uh, welcome to Wednesday. This is the third day in a row that we're streaming, and I'm stoked. Um, let's let's get rid of the music, <clears throat> so you can listen to my voice and my voice only. How's everyone? Thank you for tuning in and watching the VOD and being a supporter. Uh, I really appreciate that. Alrighty, um, today we're not playing with Kai. My goodness, was that a stream yesterday or what? <laughs> so <laughs> she actually sent me later on a uh, clip <laughs> of... Um, so anybody who watched yesterday or watched the VOD, so basically what had happened was, because um, I live in Australia and it's super hot here, uh, especially when the sun hits my apartment, uh, I turn on the AC. But once the sun is down, I don't have to have the AC running because I want to save the environment and on the electricity bi uh, bill and all that stuff. And uh, so I was like, hold on, I'll be right back. I'm going to uh, pretty quick turn off the AC and I put my stream on Be Right Back, right? And uh, for her, because she was also streaming, she was then playing. And then later on, she sent me a clip of her stream. Oh, uh, who am I talking about? Kai, of course. Um, and she sent me a straight clip of her stream, what she was doing <laughs> while I was AFK. And I just laughed. Like, it's labeled, no one tells Sab. Sab's me, by the way. <laughs> yeah, I um, had a blast and I loved playing with her. Like, how much fun was that game? How smart was she? And I think I had my moments too. Um, and we will be playing again probably next week Thursday the actual time <clears throat> the actual time is not set yet we can't do any sooner because we both have um, work stuff and Christmas stuff you know not that we celebrate Christmas but because um, work has Christmas celebrations that we are asked to uh, uh, partake in individually we don't work together uh, yeah so that was a blast yesterday and I highly recommend watching the VOD and uh, trying out the game um, Escape Simulator. It was great. What are we doing today, you may ask? Um, well, first off, it's Wednesday, my dudes. <laughs> no, just kidding. Um, house, housekeeping? Uh, next week, Monday, will be the last time we are pulling a game randomly out of a hat for a little bit. And we will be... Um, not streaming on Wednesday because of the uh, aforementioned Christmas party that I have to attend. I already have an outfit. The problem is I don't know if I want to go because I don't know if you've noticed, but there's a panorama going on for like the last two years or so. And uh, people are sick and I don't want to get sick. And it's like, a sure, it's just uh, um, employees and we're all vaccinated and stuff. But I don't know. Life is scary. Why do you think I work from home? <laughs> no, so definitely going to be a Christmas party happening. So next stream, Monday, last time for crazy shenanigans. Uh, Wednesday is no stream. We're going dark uh, for Christmas party reasons, work Christmas party. And then Thursday, we will probably be playing um, Escape Simulator again with Kai, which was a blast. We made it through Egypt yesterday. And we'll probably make it through space next Thursday. Because uh, that... Um, oh, shoot. I forgot to put my timer on. No. Fork me. Okay. Yeah. Shoot. Well, there we go. Forgot the button. Awesome. <laughs> uh, yeah, because, you know, as usual, at two hours, three minutes and 50 seconds... We will interrupt because of the router being my best friend ever. Um, where was I? Yes. So, and then Thursday we're going to play uh, Escape Simulator, going through space. It's going to be amazing. And then after the holidays or for the holidays up until January 11, uh, we're going to mix up some of the stream uh, schedule because I will have so much time on my hand. Uh, I'm not traveling. I'm not having anyone over for Christmas because I don't know if you've noticed, but 
uh, there is a pandemic going on, and um, I'm sorry to bring it up, but it's just not something I currently want to entertain, and I cannot go home because home is 27 hour flight away, and uh, international travel for uh, me currently is a little bit iffy. Like, yes. Guess what happens if you go to another country and live there? Um, travel might be weird when uh, the world is ending thanks to a virus. <laughs> Enough about me. How are you? <laughs> no, okay, so today we'll be playing Puzzle Agent. I'm excited for it. Uh, let's see how far we go. Uh, we get how far we get is what I wanted to say. Um, yeah, and then uh, after next week, we're going to mix up the schedule a little bit up until into January because I really love streaming. Uh, I enjoy it a lot and uh, I want to do it more often. So we'll do Puzzle Agent for now. We finished Dream, uh, we finished Dream Daddy once we've done with Puzzle Agent. And then I think we're going to finish Inside. And But we have so many, so many games we could play. Uh, let's see how that goes. Uh, shall we get into it? What's the button? Where's the button? Okay. Uh, mm, super. Hold up, let me move myself up here. Um, yes, so I already launched the game, as you can see. We solved last stream when we were playing this 16 puzzles. Can you believe it? And because Mr. Oh shoot, I forgot his name. Is his name Nelson? Shit. Um, Nathan? Yeah, sure. Uh, <laughs> uh, so we're an impressive investigator and because he, when he cannot figure out a puzzle, choose gum, I have prepared something. Chewing gum. Let's see if we need it. <clears throat> okay. Also, shout out to uh, Things Internet who followed me the other day after I raided her. Uh, amazing person, very lovely. Um, hold up, can we do this? Yes, oh. Thanks, internet. This is work. Yes. Uh, awesome person, always helpful. I mean, the name alone is brilliant. Okay, let's get, uh, Azaline. Oh, chewing gum. F17, look at us. Oh no, that's not where I wanted to go. Nope, we're going back inside. Uh, does anybody remember what we were doing? I don't. Um. Journal? Uh, oh yeah, so we were we are in Scoggins, Minnesota. I love Minnesota. Such lovely weather. I miss it very much. And then she moves to Australia. Why? Um, the we've talked about the we talked to the owner. We went to the eraser factory, which we currently cannot enter because we're missing a gear or cog or something. Um, something is weird about the hotel fence. Um, we found my glob frozen at the lake and somehow didn't. No. Uh, some weird creature startled us. It looked like a gnome. Um, and then we found half-eaten fish. Uh, we're checking for alibis. Heard a crash. Okay. No, wait. Didn't I just grab that? I can grab it twice. Oh my god, did we find a bug? Hold up. Journal. Scrolling through it. Back. Back. Nope. Never mind. Okay. Um. Shoot, what are we doing? Goodbye. We cannot talk. Fork me. Um. Well, Mr. Scruffman's alibi checks out. Mike Lobb is dead. And I just saw living garden gnomes. I think I'm gonna head back to the diner and have a chat with Sheriff Fogg. You know, I'm pretty... <clears throat> Sorry. I'm pretty glad 
that I stopped where I did because now we had a summary from what we did last time because it's been a week since we played. He said we're going to the diner. That's... I checked up on the repairman. He was working at the hotel on the night of the accident. Alibi checked out, huh? He's in the clear. He couldn't have been involved. Have you looked into Bjorn and his friends? He seems to be an avid environmentalist. Perhaps the accident is a political statement. Nah. Bjorn's always been a major part of this community. Since even before my badge was pinning up my diapers. You wore a sheriff's badge on your diapers? This is a community that celebrates its Nordic heritage, Agent Tethers. Not one that advocates violence. Oh yeah, uh, Nelson Tethers is our name. Have you heard about this hidden people superstition? Hidden people? Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. Uh. You had me going there, Tethers. A government agent investigating elves and hippie legends. <laughs> uh, yeah. How'd you go in there? Well, sounds like you have had a busy day. Let's wrap it up for today and start fresh tomorrow. But you haven't really done anything. And oh, we're boy. no closer to getting that factory up and running. <clears throat> Agent Tethers, I'm not from the big city. Around here, we take our time. Keep our heads clear. As far as I can tell, everyone's heads are filled with puzzles. Puzzles are a way to keep yourself from asking questions you don't want answers to. What does that Ooh. mean? It means I'll see you in the morning, Agent Tethers. Dun dun dun. I forgot what we were looking at those. There's some tobacco on the counter. It smells like cherry. I guess the waitress hasn't been in much of a cleaning mood lately. Oh yeah, we said that before. Um chewing gum. Well then, where are we going instead? We're gonna get startled again. Mm. Can we go to bed? Is that a thing? Is that an option? Again? I'd better not. Hmm. No, we've discovered all of this stuff here. Um. What's our next move? Shoot balls. What is our next move? Were we supposed to talk to someone? I feel a little stuck. I hate it. What other places can we go to? Let's go back to the factory? None of these gears fit on this door. That, that's a good way to start the stream, isn't it? Getting stumped. <laughs> Was I supposed to talk to more people? How are you doing, Steve? Oh. Out of curiosity, anything else you want to tell me about these birds? They're smart. I once saw a black-bellied whistling duck open a car door and steal a cream cheese danish. That's... Wow. Oh! Okay, hold up. Uh, rules. A mallet can carry two gnomes per leg, so that's four in total. An owl, an owl 1.5, a bluebird one. Do, do we want to write this down like last time? Keep doing that. 
Isn't it great that we're saving in a razor factory? <laughs> okay. Okay, okay, okay. It's so funny. Like, last night we played so long. Uh, I was absolutely dead tired all day. And now I'm pretty much awake. Do you just hate when that happens? I bet you I can't sleep tonight. Um, and that's going to be so annoying. Okay. Duck. Two per leg. Um, so that's four in total. An owl. 1.5 per leg. That's three. And a bluebird. One mix two. Birds may team up on heavy loads, each carrying what he can. Freight must be balanced evenly between the bird's two legs. Lines can't cross or the shipment will become tangled. Okay, so... That makes sense. So he can carry two more. Uh, a blue bird can carry two in, uh, uh, in total. One, two, three, four, five... So three need to be carried still. So that's two f carried by this dude. Um, two carried by this one and one by them. One, two, three, four, five. Yes. One, two, three, four, five. Um, an owl can carry three. The total, so two are left. The duck carries the rest. I feel so smart. For Wednesday? After three streams in three days? Well, that and a long so workday? Hello again, Daryl. And Daryl. <laughs> uh, stack of chairs. Those chairs weren't here before, were they? Nope. One of them Nordic guys brought them in right after I ordered my pie. Pie that I'm still waiting for! Hmm. Something odd mm, about that. Hi. Something's spray painted on the stack of Escher chairs. Oh god, Escher chairs. Arrange them to discover a secret image. Oh, they can turn. That's gross. No. <laughs> Oh, my brain is doing funny things. Okay, um... That's not a face. Okay, I'm going to move them all in, and then we can see what the fork is going on. Almost! Okay... Maybe. Oh, oops. Change my name to Puzzle Lady. Puzzle Wizard. That 
that image you just made? That's the symbol those lodge guys use. Really? Interesting. What do you guys know about Bjorn? Oh, you mean the old hippie who spies on people out by the hotel? He's one of those old Nordic guys who hangs out at the lodge. Brothers of Skagens or something like that. Oh, that Brothers sounds creepy. And weirdos, if you ask me. Lodge, huh? I'll check it out. Um, did they have more Hello stuff? Hello again, Daryl. And mm, Daryl. Hidden people. Okay, this might sound silly, but have you guys ever heard about hidden people? My cousin's neighbor saw one once. Oh, not this again. He swears they're real. So do those Nordic tree huggers, but that doesn't make it so. So the hidden people are just a bunch of make-believe then? Yep. Not according to my cousin's neighbor. I don't see the waitress around. Did she go somewhere? That's a good question. I ordered some key lime about 20 minutes ago. Um. How are you doing, Steve? Do you know anything about hidden people? Collectors will pay a tidy sum for a wooden one. But you don't believe in them, do you? Do I seem crazy to you? <laughs> okay. Hey, Steve. Okay, so we can't talk to the lady. Bjorn is starting to look more and more suspicious. I just got a tip that he holds secret meetings in a local lodge. I remember seeing something about a lodge on my Skagen's map. Skagen's. I wonder if it's the same one. Skagen of Skagen, Brotherhood of Skagens. There's some bright orange cloth caught on this sign. I wonder if Mike Lobb was trying to get away from this place in a hurry. Have you ever seen The Mentalist? For some reason, this reminds me of The Mentalist when he goes in and there's several people. And someone gets away and he finally finds the... What's his face? The dude he's been following. The door to the lodge is locked. It seems to be your standard locking device. A lock. Maybe a deadbolt. Looks like someone doesn't want me to see what's going on inside. Well, they probably shouldn't have made this a puzzle then. Draw a single straight line from one red dot to another that will slice through every barrier blocking the window. One straight, as if I could relate to that. Um, okay, so if we cross through here... Nope, hold up. Wait, what? One line that cuts through everything? Nope. Oh, I can do several. No, I can only do one. Okay, let's see. If I have this line... This is still not... Oh, okay, but this doesn't get broken if I put it there. Um, draw a single straight line from one red dot to another that will slice through every barrier blocking the window. Okay, so the chains are... So the chains are easy because if I cut it here or there or there or there, they'll fall apart. The problem is the um, wood.
Okay, all four boards are being cut. Is it four boards? Yes. The black chain and the blue chain get cut. The gray chain gets cut, and this should fall because... Should we try it? Okay, remember what we did. One down, one there. Uh, one down. Right, yeah. It's probably wrong. Watch this. Okay, this is cut. This is cut. This is cut. This is cut. 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 Are you trying? Let's try it. You know, the moment I call myself smart and then fail. Are they howling? If you want a good look around, you might try knocking on the door. Sheriff Buck! Oh, you startled me. Snooping doesn't suit you, Agent Tatters. What are you doing here? What the heck is going on in there? They meet regularly and celebrate their cultural tradition. But that's their business, not yours. Ooh. I'm pretty sure I saw Glory Dabner in there. The waitress? I doubt it. She was standing right there a second ago. There's something about this crew that seems off to me. Agent Chathers, you're here to get the factory back open. Not to question or belittle the beliefs of the townsfolk. Time to go, Agent Chathers. I'll escort you back to the hotel. Anybody else expecting there to be bees involved at the end of this? Make it an early night. And turn in, Agent Chathers. I don't want to see you out here again tonight. Food. Trust me, you don't want to be out here either. Mm. Well, Sheriff Bog definitely isn't working with me. I'm sure I saw Glory Davner at the lodge. Wait, what? Isn't that also her? And now Glory Davner's sneaking around town. I'm going to follow her. How? Nelson still got snowmobile trouble. Rearrange the log so he will track through all footprints before arriving at Glory's destination. Okay, so there's a similar uh, uh, thingy that we had before. I re aimed the log so that um, he turns, basically. <clears throat> Coming down, go here, going up, no, going up, going down again, going this, going down again, he, um, hold up, hold up, hold up, we could, we could, we could. Make him go down here. Make him turn up. Make him that way. Uh, make him go that way. Go down again. Okay. 
Nope. Okay, so we have to go through all the footsteps to then go to the center, right? I mean, they don't say you can't go a second time. So if we were to go down... Get turned around. Go through here. Turn down. Go there. Go up. Then we touched all the footprints, but not the question mark. Nope. Okay, so we go down, we go here, we go up. Um, we go up, up again. And then here. Okay, so down this way. This way, this way, that way, oh shoot, that way, nope. Going down, going this way. Going back up, going that way, so we have this covered. We go here. Nope, wait, hold up. Down, up, over. Nope. Okay, so if we go down here, up here, I know what to do. Down, over, up. Okay, okay, down, over, up. No, we're going to bump in here. Okay, so... <clears throat> I don't know why they're placed that way, if that's a hint or not. Um, my problem is... 
I don't know why I want to point at it. You can't see my hands. I'm weird at pointing. No. Uh, my thought is... You can only reach this from this side. Because there's this uh, hindrance, right? If we were to go down all the way around here, but we wouldn't have to go. Nope, that's also not correct. Fuck. Down, over, up. This way, this way, this way. This way, this way. And then end. Yeah, no, that's not right. So down, over, up. Here, there, there. Okay, down, over, up over here oh my god do we have it also if i have to say down over up one more time A minute. Glory was headed toward the factory. I gotta catch up with her. What is she? She's that's food. What kind of food? is it? Eggs or is it food? Dun, dun, dun. Is this scary? Is this supposed to be scary? I heard there's a second game. I mean, the sheriff did tell us to go to bed. It's chewing gum. I'm in space. foreman isaac davner what happened to you is this aliens what are those things the gnomes was that real <laughs> yes what is it <sighs> the whispers were creepy as fuck Draw paths to reconnect the loose ends, red to red, yellow to yellow, but they're careful not to let the wires cross. Path segment can run between any two adjoining. Oh no, it's flickering. What a bitch. 
No, 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 no. We have a problem with that. Uh, we can't. Oh, fuck. How do you open the, the, the settings? Shit. Um, yeah, so here's a fun thing. I cannot play this. <sighs> Hello? House of Backwards, that's cool. Um, that's flickering, I hate flickering. Um, Good night, friend. Unconscious in the woods. Did they speak to you? Did who speak to me? I'm looking at a photograph of the Brotherhood. Isaac and Mike Lobb seem to be part of this group, and they seem to be friends. Interesting. Okay, I'm gonna need some real answers now. What exactly is going on here? What's wrong with these people? They are in deep meditation. If you open your mind and let yourself hear the whispers, there will be no mysteries in life. You cannot solve. Speak to them yourself if you want solutions. What are these little creatures I keep seeing? They are not creatures. They are people, older than any of us, living in what nature still exists around us. Isaac Davner's still alive, isn't he? The lock on the factory door. He didn't build it himself. You put it there to keep him in. Or to keep people out. Why? He has been spoken to. It is actually a great honor to have been chosen. Chosen for what? That is not for us to ask. I'm gonna need a second to question these people. Do what you must. Okay, I want to check something in the settings. That flickering was bullshit. It's not an option. <sighs> You see them, don't you? Listen to their words. Their riddles. 
Edward knows it's time to stop the Windowatchee River. Windowatchee River with her callbacks. Back to four clutches of fish to release points. You can mine these wolves. Schools will swim towards the rivers, splitting evenly at each fork. A school can't split evenly, will be paralyzed with indecision. Marsh marmots will eat all fish who enter their turf. The marmots are either in mythic marsh or abominable swamp, but not both places. Exactly 16 fish must arrive safely at the river, no more, no less. Okay. Okay, if I put six here, they're gonna split up, three will be here. And then we're gonna make them an even number again, where three come down here and three there. Um, I'm going to put... How many is that? Eight here, which leaves four to here. That makes it eight. What does I say three? How many do you have to go back? Rules. Sixteen must make it. Shit. Um, let's switch these around then. Um, no, that's gonna be an uneven number. Okay, uh, this is eight. Four. We'll go here. And four there. And it splits up four here and four there. And four here. And these will be three that way and three that way. Some will get eaten and then we're even here. Well, remember whether the marmots are lurking in the marsh or the swamp exactly 16 fish marmots. Exactly. How many of these creatures eat fish? Will all of them be eaten? All the fish who enter the turf. Okay, if... I mean... Okay, so we split these up, right? Um, meaning we get through here potentially, and four get through potentially, which could mean seven get there. Um, uh, we go through here with those, it makes six. Whereas three could be eaten, or three go into the water. So we have maybe three going into the water. No, we definitely have three going to water, maybe six. I have to write this down. Hold up. <laughs> By the way, if there's another scene that flashes, I think I'm gonna end stream. Uh, not to be, uh, like strict or rude or anything it's just it makes me dizzy and we can't do that okay um okay the four here will turn into two and two. Uh, and with the eight down here, 10 will definitely, absolutely make it to the water. Meaning out of the up ones up here, some have to survive. Let's say the abomin uh, ab abdominal swamp is full of mud mama thingies, whatever they're called. That means they get to eat two and 
three makes it. Yeah, so if it's in the abdominal swamp, I think we'll get 16. If it's if they are in the myth pick, we'll get uh eight, twelve. 15. So if it's wrong now, hold up. Oh, well, you know what? Let's just submit it. And that's wrong. We're going to ask for a hint. The smallest clutch of fish should be released in the safest spot. Okay, so the threes go here because they definitely make it to the water. Okay. Yeah, I was thinking like we need even numbers, but they don't have to be even. They go directly into the water. Duh. Okay, so if they get split up, five of them definitely make it into the water. Okay, let's say eight. They split up, so it's four. Seven make it into the water. Um... um or make it here, but they get eaten. Six or three might make it to the water. That's ten. Well, if the creatures are sitting here, three out of those don't make it. They're in here. Four don't make it. But if these split up here, they're going to make an uneven number, right? So this has to be this way. She. So three plus three is six. Thus, potentially two is eight. Plus, potentially four is. The group of four fish will suffer some losses before they reach river, no matter where the marmots are hiding. Meaning the four go here. Why am I stupid all of a sudden? Uh. Maybe I need chewing gum just like him. That's a piece of the machine locking the factory. Where did you get that? All we can do is open our minds. The language of the hidden ones is expressed in puzzles. Blind Lars Jorksen's mother knitted, knitted him 25 pairs of socks. Five striped, five fled, five spotted, five argyle, and five with owl, owls playing fiddle. That means 50 socks. Being a teenager, Lars failed to repair to, to pair his socks and threw them randomly in his drawer. How many socks must Lars pull out before he can be absolutely certain he is holding at least one matching pair?
My housemate is really good at that stuff. Like the first thing when you, it comes to his mind when you talk about dice is probabilities. Like what? Okay, we pull one out. Let's say it's a, it's a, it's a, an owl, right? We pull out another one. It could be one out of five. I'm just gonna guess six. Cause I don't know. I I'm too old, too tired. I had a gut feeling. Basically, if it's always one out of five, then out of the five I took, one would be the one. That's it. Only one more piece. There's several pieces I here. I don't think so, Agent Tethers. I need to get the rest of the broken pieces from the brothers to fix this. I don't think so. Rocks, trees, animals. Do you ever just stop and watch the birds, Mr. Tethers? Hmm. A quorum of crows. Congregating in rows, an alignment for close, is an omen of woes. Yon has photos that show a quorum of crows on his clothesline, a dark omen. Keeping in mind, the images may overlap. What's the minimum numbers of crows pictured? Can I move shit around? No. Okay. These are definitely two that we can count. Because they're clearly marked left and right. These two could also be the ones in this picture. But they cannot be the ones in this picture. So we have two, three, five. This one could be this one, so we don't count it. So what is it? Two, three, five. We don't count this one. We don't count these. And this one could be that one, so we're not counting it. And this one could be that one, so we're not counting it. So it's six. Please be right. Rude. Fully overlapping. Oh, oh, shoot. I missed that this one could be that one. I wish we could move them around. Fuck me. Mm. <laughs> um. Okay. 
let's say these two birds are the same. That makes this officially two that we are going to count. Um, so this one is in fact a bird we are going to count. That's three. That bird can be that one. So we're not counting it. No, no, wait, hold up. Yes. Oh, okay. This bird is that bird. I'm just going to say that. So let's count these two. Count that bird. So. These two could be these two birds. So we're not counting them. They could also be these two birds. So we're not counting those. This bird could be that bird. This bird could be that bird. And this bird could be that bird. But that bird is definitely different. Oh god, please. We're gonna take a hint, thank you very much. When images are superimposed correctly, there's a bluebird at each end of the line. Oh, we're making the end of the line. Okay. Sure. Um. So this bird is that bird. So we don't count it. No, hold up. Bullshit. This is the end. So these two we can count. Which could be these two. Yes. So we do definitely have these two, right? Which can be these two, so we have we, we count these. That could also be those two. But not those two. This one could be that one, so we're not counting him. This one is the same. And this one could be the same, so we're five. Fuck me sideways. So my first guess was six, my second guess was four. Guess what? It was five in the end. That's all of the pieces. Now I just need to reassemble them. This gear appears to be one of those assemble it yourself dealies. Can you fit the pieces together? Fuck me. Damn it. Where Fucking are you, asshole. You thief? Hmm. 
Arrange the logs to help Mouse to collect the stolen pieces of the broken gear and discover where the gnome is hiding. Oh, again. Okay, down, over, up, here. We got this one. We got those two. We got those two. We got those two. Those two. That one. Those again. That one again. No, what's up there? This one, this one. Should we try it? Oh, 
Oh my god, did I make it? No way. Thing stole the last piece I need to get into the factory. Looks like it's headed toward the lake. Bjorn's people may try to protect it. I'm not sure. Either way, I'm getting that piece back. Wait, we're headed to the lake? We're going to get locked in. Hey, let me out! You don't understand! The hidden people need Isaac! I don't know why, but you have to let him go with them! I'm not going to let you people keep him locked up in a factory like fate! I'm sorry! Get out of here! The key to the skylight is inside one of these dead fish, but which hurry and find it. The ice fishing hut is sinking fast. Each fish has one or other fish inside, except the one with the key. Counting swallowed fish, the whiskered red fish is the least numerous kind here. All fish dine on the next rung of the food chain, except tiny tan fish who eat their own kind. The key is on a line with five fish. What? Oh. No, we have to... Oh, okay, okay. I was like, wait, we're looking at the rules and then we... What? <laughs> Each has one other fish inside except the one with the key. Swallowed fish, the whiskered red fish is the least numerous kind. So, red eats blue, eats green, eats yellow. So, red ate a blue one. It ate a green one, which ate a yellow one. So, that's four in the red fish. That's probably wrong. Told you. So does red eat blue, eat green, eat yellow? And yellow eats yellow? I need a hint. I'm stumped as fuck. Come again? There are 19 fish in the picture. 10 are visible. 
Nine are somewhere inside. If redfish is the least numerous, there must be exactly five of every other type represented. I'm gonna write that one down. Jesus Christ. Also, what's with the fish all the time? Nineteen. All kinds. Five. And then key. But who eats who? Does red eat blue eat green? Oh, wait. What if green eats blue? Because they're supposed to be five blues, which means they're in someone's tummy. There's supposed to be five green. I, I I don't know. Help is welcome, by the way. Um So they eat the smaller ones. See, that's information I didn't have. That's just me. So, next smaller. Okay, um, red fish eat blue fish. So in uh, one of these are also blue fish. No, wait, in, in, in three of these. Hold up. It says the key is line with five fish, right? So in this one could be a blue and a green one. That's three. There could be a green one in here. So this is too many. So these two guys would eat yellow fish. And he would only eat his own kind. And the yellow could be in here and there. And there. Oh my god, I have no idea. <laughs> Today's not going so well.
Okay, there have to be four yellows somewhere. They would be there, there, there. And in one of these. Maybe. No, 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 hold up. In a green one in one of these. Or in a green one in one of these. I don't know. Oh. Keys are aligned with five fish. So this one. Because there's a green one in here, and the yellow one in there, and there's the key. Probably not. Oh my god. Close call. Agreed. What the heck happened here, Agent Tethers? Sheriff Bob, Glory Davner tried to kill me. Come on, Tethers. You sure that sweet little girl? Sheriff, I swear, she is not as innocent as she looks. Okay, I'll go find her and ask her a few questions. You stay out of trouble now. Is he for real? Stay out of trouble? She is trouble. Oh. I like my office. It's warm in my office. <laughs> it's quiet in my office. There are no maniacal gnomes or chainsaw wielding waitresses in my office. Oh. I need to get back to the lodge, fix that gear, and get the hell out of here. Is nobody going to take care of the frozen lobster? Asking for a friend. So why are we going to lodge? Okay, let's get this gear back together. I think I might be a visual puzzle person, not a logic puzzle person, which is so smart if you play puzzle games. I can't let you go. This is intense. You just don't come into our town and pretend you know how everything works. I think I'm starting to figure it out. Is there humming coming from the mic? It's pitching. Okay, weird. Maybe it's a microwave. No, AC. <laughs> air, air control. Uh, conditioning. Wait, where are we going? Are you serious? Sheriff says crooked as they come. Looks like he's sabotaged my snowmobile. A 
Okay, what we can we Okay. Fee visuals, my shit. <clears throat> I'm with the FBI, Department of Puzzle Research. If you're still in there, don't worry. I'm coming in to rescue you. Nelson's three gears come, seem to come apart and it looks like the pieces can be rearranged to one giant gear. Can you get it in, in gear to solve this? Yeah, I think visual puzzles are absolutely my thing. Miss me with that logic sh <laughs> Just kidding. Pew pew. That was a tricky one. Sure pretty though. Dun dun dun. Also, is this still the same day where we arrived, or is it the next day? Air traps. Isaac. Stay there. I'm coming to get you.
barbed wire. Oh, hello. Yes. Yes. Blocked. If, if the circumference of the Earth is four times that of the moon, then... I swear I'm not going to hurt you. I just need to clear this path and we can get out of here. Nelson's path is blocked by a giant Scoggins eraser. Cut the support to drop this obstacle, but don't drop Nelson by mistake. What? Hmm. 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 I'll be back in a second. Well, hello. What's next? Is where go we back. need to go? Oh, there. Rotate the tiles and... Uh, if X is lying, please. Hmm. If you can get this furnace hot enough, it may blast away the remaining debris. Pack objects into your opening, but don't let them overlap. Overlap with each other? Okay. Oh, something just clicked in place. Okay, I can look for that. Um.
No. Wait, did this just click in place? Oh, it clicked in place with other things. Well, that makes it easy, right? You could like just wiggle shit around like you wanted to. Oh, that's not what I was getting at, though. <laughs> okay. No, stay there. No, I won't. Oh, okay. Yeah, sure. Fill that out for me if you will. Nope. Oh, it, be it is it is a thing. No, I want to move this thing. Mm -hmm -hmm. No, can you please stay in place? Or does it go over here? Nah, it's overlap. Um, stay in place. I want the box. I want the box. I still want the box. Oh, what else? Blub? Oh, okay, cool. Nope. Nope. I don't. I don't want to. I don't want to touch this. How do I? Move the freaking vacuum cleaner. Thank you. There. Nelson could just maneuver the three hydraulic lifts into place. He could reach the office door, drag the arrows to create a command sequence, but beware of bear traps. Oof. Drag and drop arrows onto the monitor to construct a command line. Each arrow moves all lifts at once. Okay. Commands execute. Mm, I think my housemate just did something to the AC. Um. It is getting cold for me, smiley face. Okay. Um, where were we? Um, commands execute in order from left to right and rows from top to bottom. Left to right, top to bottom. So as if you were reading in the Western world. A lift will be stopped by a wall or other barrier. A lift will stop moving when it reaches its goal. Don't let any lift encounter a bear trap or it will be destroyed. Jesus. Okay, so we go up for all of them. Up one. one to the right because one and two will go up up one to the right one to the right uh three cannot go right so it stays in place um up up right up up right up 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 right up Um, okay, one goes up, up, right, up, up. Oh no! What is this game?
Thank you. This game is I don't know why they're doing this, you know, jump scare shit. I mean not jump scare, just jump scare. Um, but yeah. Again? Okay. Uh all of them can go up, up, and to the right. Uh three will be stuck, but that's okay. So up up to the right. Up up to the right is great. Up up to the right to up. It's perfect for both of them. Up, up, right, up, up. Up, up, right, up, up. Another up will put two into place. Then we want um, one to go right and up. And when one and two are in place, we can un un undo um, three by going left, up, up, left, up, up, We're running out of... Okay, 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 undo. Can I undo? Reset. We want all of them to go up twi- oops. Twice. We could then go left. So one would be stuck in that direction, so against the wall. Two would one go over, would go one over, and three would go here. <laughs> and then in tandem, two and three can slot into places one and three. Okay, so up, up, left. Oh shit, one will have a problem. Because if we do up, up, left, that's fine. But if we do another up, it's on broken. Okay, up, up, left. What was it? Um, the rules. A lift will stop moving when it reaches its goal. That means... I mean, one doesn't have to go there, two doesn't have to go there, and three not there, right? So if we do up, up, left... I don't want one to get broken. Mm. So up up right was kind of correct up up right up 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 right up 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 right up up two can lock into place if it wants to or we do up up right up up right up didn't i just have this and then with, with that two up right up up right up Yes. And then three will still be here. So we need to be three left. Wait, what did we say where it ends up? Up, right, up, up, right, up. 
Yeah, so three will be stuck here. We go one left and one, two, three up. One left. One, two, three. Okay, let's follow this. Up, up, right. Up, up, right, up. Stuck in place. Up, up, right, up, up, right, up. Stuck in place. Up, up cannot go right it's gonna stay up cannot go up up cannot go up cannot go right cannot go up can go left can go up can go up can go up Hydraulic headache. Welcome to my life. Constant headache. Okay, once we know what's behind this door, That's I think it. we're gonna end stream. Let's get out of here. Why? Why what? Did he just shoot with his eyes closed? Did they just catch the bullets with their teeth? That's cool. Man, that's some dark shit. Well done, agent. Tethers. Heck of a job. You got that factory back open, and the president is pleased as punch. Really? Well, he was never actually aware of the West Wing's racer shortage. Mm -hmm. But rest assured, I'm sure he's happy to have not had to strike anything through. Oh, thank you, sir. Now back to work. Sir, about the factory foreman, Isaac Davner. Doesn't concern us, Tethers. Any missing persons can be handled by local law enforcement. But... You did your job. That'll be all. Oh, okay. Hey, Tethers. What's a nine-letter word for baffling? Recondite, sir. Ha! Huh. Thanks a million, Tethers. No wonder you're our star puzzle agent. Thank you, sir. Okay. Wait, the game is over? Okay. Uh, oh no, there's two I didn't do. I think two or three I, I haven't done. Oh boy. Well, isn't that something? It's over. Okay. You know what? I can live with that. This was a long enough stream. Um, yeah. Thank you for joining me. Uh, let me turn this off because it's distracting me. Um, thank you for joining. Since we're done with Puzzle Agent, um, I'm going to change the schedule. <laughs> uh, on Monday, we'll do the hat thing again where we pull out a random uh, a game out of a hat. There's not many left, so we'll see how interesting that'll be. Um, I also bought a new game that looks cool. Um, I'm looking forward to playing that on stream at some point. Soon-ish, we'll see. Uh, no stream on Wednesday next week because reasons um, not just kidding uh, because of the Christmas party for my uh, for work and I'll um, uh, but I'm, I'll be streaming with um, Kai on Thursday we don't know the time yet and it's gonna be fun thank you should we find someone to raid maybe hmm Mm. 
Is anyone on? Yeah, why not? Let's go over to Milo. Very lovely human being. Uh, currently playing Animal Crossing. Uh, please um, try and always follow their rules as usual because that's what you do. Um, fun person, say hi uh, and enjoy. Yeah, the the rest of of your evening day, whichever one <laughs> you do. Um, wait, can you hear her? Am I sharing this? No, I'm not. Okay, thank you so much, and uh, have a lovely night. See you Monday.